शुक्लां ब्रह्म विचार सार परमा महाद्यान जगत व्यापिनी वीणा पुस्तक धारिणी हस्ते स्पाटिक मालिकां विदधती पद्मासने संस्थितां वंदे तां परमेश्वरी भगवती बुद्धि प्रदाम शारदा दत्वा सरस्वती देवी शुद्धा गुण्यां कौम्यहम पाणिनी प्रवेशाय लघु सिद्धांत कौमुदी Any questions with Ekasho, Basho, Bhash, Jashanta, Sis, Doho? I said we'll go, we'll go over, so I'll go over quickly if there are no questions, otherwise we'll spend some time. No questions, no doubts, right? It's understood. Okay. Anyway, so Ekacho, Basho, Bhash. So, Bash and Bhash, those who, I mean, uh, sometimes we make mistake with Mahaprana and uh, Murdhanya here. So, Shakara and Shakara, Shakara Shankar Shakara and Shanmuk Shakara, difference is lost for many and Bakara and Bhakara, so, that's also lost. If we don't know which is the Stani, so everything will sound same which is the Sani, which is the Adesha. So it's easier to understand as the Alpa Prana takes Maha Prana Adesha. When, when it is a Jashanta Anga of Jashanta Anga of what? See, Ekacha Jashanta Sya Dhatu Avayasya. It is a Jashanta Ekach belonging to a Dhatu. Dhatu need not be ekach, the single ach in which segment is there that is called as ekach and that segment is part of a dhatu. So dhatu can be an ekach in which that ekach ending ekach should be, just see what is ending ekach, there will be ach in between and there will be hull on both sides, that is what ekach is, ekach is that segment where there is only one vowel and on both sides you will have a hull, in this case especially. In this case, you will have like a, uh, if you pull on a branch of a tree, then whatever is connected on both sides comes down. On every, whatever is connected comes down. So this is like pulling one vowel. You pull vo one vowel till you hit another vowel on either side, what comes down is a catch. Okay, so a dhatu which can be an ekach in which the last ekach ends with a jash letter, then the bash within that ekach will take bhash adesha, will take mahaprana adesha. So bash takes bhash. So it can, it is also called as bhash bhavaha at some places. Example we saw is duh dhatu by utsarga. This Hakara at the end of the Dohudatu would have taken, would have taken Dha Adesha by Hodaha. However, this is an Apoada. The, and then Ghat Adesha by Dadher Dhatur Gha, it took Gha Adesha. Now what happens to this Dakara in this Dugh, which is part of Ekach, now Jashanta, and Part of a dhatu. Ekach is part of a dhatu. Dhatu itself happens to be ekach here. What happens to this dakara which is bash? It takes bhasha desha. Thereby it becomes dakara becomes mahaprana. It becomes dhakara. So you get dug becomes dhug and dhug dhakara by jhalam jashuante becomes alpa prana. So the earlier became mahaprana, the latter became Alpaprana. Then Vavasa nature, you got Kakara. So Dhug and Dhuk are the forms in this. Then not only Antasya Padante, Jali Padante, but Jali Padante is Saptami, Ekvachana, both of these. We saw Padanta example. Now look at the example of C and C. Doho, Se Dve. 
said the examples are not covered padanta example is covered because he is looking at subanta this say meaning see sakara when will sakara follow in uh, uh, in uh, tinganta madhyam purusha ekvachana dve in madhyam purusha bhuvachana he is not going to cover this and when when he covers tinganta in tinganta prakhe he will assume if this sutra applies he will assume that it has been covered and he will just not even mention it and move on he may say bhash bhava or may not say so we will just go through a set of examples here in c and dv say c and dv so that the example is complete so c is what paramas parasmai pada this is parasmai c c example is Duhu plus C. Duhu plus C. What happens here? I'll write say here. Since Lagukara says say, we'll go with say. So say sakar sakare pare sakare pare in duhu plus sip sip pratya. What happens here? Okay. this is becoming a little irritating uh, it's it's slow because the document is big <coughs> so do plus c all of this after anubandha lopa you get do do plus c pakara will also go do plus c hakara becomes what hakara will become <coughs> gha dader dhatur gha so we'll get dug dug plus c by what dader dhatur gha then is this is this uh, khar or not so here what applied dader dader dhatur gha utsarga is dhakara hodha but this is a dadi dhakara adi dhatu therefore dader dhatur gha instead of dhakara there is ghakara adesha so it became dug Now I'll, I'll remove this dug. Dug plus c. Will, I'll keep it dug c. So after dug c, what will happen? Sakara is a khar letter. So khari cha, khari cha char. So dug will become ga gakara. You'll get uh, khari cha char. Char will be first of this class. So you'll get gakara. Of course, it can go through uh, gakara also by jalam uh, jash jashi. Uh, no, it, Sakara is not a just letter, so you 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 will get this Duxi. Duxi by what? Actually, uh, let me look at the number. Uh, I have to look at the number eight to thirteen nine. So where is our uh, eight to thirteen? Let me open a study because the sequence we have to be important about sequence in the Tripadi. Uh, Otherwise, any sequence would work. Here, although sequence may not matter, but still we have to be accurate. Eight to thirty seven. No markings here. Eight to thirty-seven is our sutra here. Ekacho basho bhash yashandasya doho. So whether this will apply first or or which sutra? So dader dhator gha is earlier thirty-two. So that will apply. Then eight to thirty-seven. Ekacho basho bhash. Jashantasya doho. So this will apply, and then we'll go to the fourth pada, where we'll have khari cha ityadi. So the sequence is all right. So dukshi. Uh, here you'll get duk dukshi. Sorry, dukshi. So you'll get dukshi. So dukshi by what? By ekacho basho bash basho bash. I don't know what I'm typing because I can't see it on the screen. Bash jashantasya doho. 
you have finished typing it is yet to come up okay jashan tasyas do so not dhaksi dhugsi then this dhakara will become dhakara will become kakara you will get dhuks dhuksi by by khara was kharicha sorry khari cha then because it is <coughs> sakara which is preceded by in actually dhuks dup c it is not preceded by in it is in ko ho ku it is preceded by ku so in ko ho and sakara happens to be a part of a pratyaya sakara sip is a pratyaya therefore it will take murdhanya adesha by uh, adesha pratyayo so adesha pratyayo will cause this to become sakara and you will get deformed dukshi that like adesha प्रत्ययो प्रत्ययो एक्चुअली आई मे हैव नॉट अप्लाइड अनदर सूत्र बिकॉज आई एम जस्ट डूइंग संधीज आई फॉरगॉट द अंग कार्य सो वॉट कैन सी वॉट इज वॉट कैन ऑफ अ दिस इज अट इट इज अ पिथ प्रत्यय It is a pith pratyaya. So even before we reach here, this form will have become what? It will have become do, do, do plus sip. Because pakara, this pakara will take away. So this it is a, it is a pith pratyaya. So it it will cause guna. It is a artha sadhu ka pratyaya. Uh, it is. See, thing shit sarvadhatukam. So it is a sarvadhatukam pratyaya. So I'll have to apply. I didn't want to go through all these sutras, so I missed it. Thing shit sarvadhatukam. I may have mentioned this sutra earlier. So if you don't recall, only kit nit and kit and nit pratyaya. Generally, kit and nit pratyaya deny guna or vridhi on the iglakshana guna or vridhi of the anga. वॉट है पुगंत लघु उपद सो पुगंत इट इज अ लघु उपद इट इज नॉट पुगंत पुगंत इज अनदर कंडीशन वेर इट विल टेक गुण सो हियर पुकार इज अ लघु उपद इट इज एन उपद ऑल राइट पेनल्टी मेट लेटर एंड देन इट इज लघु मीनिंग दैट इट इज अ शॉर्ट वॉवल सो पुगंत पुगंत लघु उपद किं भवति गुण So there will be a guna, lagu upadasthicha guna, and thereby you will get doh. So all of this will change. I ignore the anga karya because tinganta we are not doing. This is not the focus. So anga karya is a little lost right now. So any doubts here? Sakara is following. Therefore, this doh, this sakara condition applies here. Earlier we saw this jashantasya padantasya padantasya jali padante there padante we have seen the example dhuk and or dhug and stohos sakare pare this is the example sakare pare uh, so dhokshi in atmane pada dhukshe dhokshi or dhukshe also I think do dhatu would be ubhay padi dhatu. So, duh dhatu is ubhaya padi. Uh, let me cross check. Yeah, it's not shown here. Yeah, and it uh, duh dhatu. Yeah, duh prapurane. Uh, it is uh, ubhaya padi. Therefore, dukshe by what? I'll just mention here. Du plus se. I think it uh, 
says the set becomes this here you will get Sudukshe actually not say Thaatam Jatas Thas to Thasas say so I will have to say Thas first and then say Thas which becomes say Thasas say So, thas is the pratyaya here, thas, thas is se, thereby it will become se, I will take a shortcut method, I will not write everything, so dhukshi, same meaning as dhukshi, except that dhukshi, here the, the cow is being milked for my own purpose, the milk is not for anyone else, here the milk is for someone other than me as well. So, uh, not me, the karta, I mean the whoever is the karta, so here Madhyama Purusha, whoever is milking, so you who are milking, you who are milking the cow, are, the milk is not only for you, it is for someone else also. Here, the, you who are milking, the milk is for you alone, not for anyone else. At least, the, when you are milking, the karma, the phala of the karma will go to the karta. So, in the intention, whether someone visits later and then you share the milk is a different story, but then uh, that's the general idea of this difference between the Atmane Padam Pratya and the Parasme Padam Pratya in a Ubhayapadi situation. Then in Lrit also, you will get this Dhokshyate. I will not go into that again. So, this here, uh, you can see clearly Atmane Pada and then here shows you that it is uh, it is lit lakara and here being an ardha dhatuka causes guna on the anga. The, our focus here is this becoming dhakara. Our focus in this sutra is dhakara becoming dhakara meaning bhash taking bhash bhava. What is the dhve example? Dhve is madhyam purusha bhau vachana dhvam, dhvam pratyasu. Thas atam dhvam. So that dhvam makara is replaced by ekara. So you get dhve. And then duha duha dhve. It will become dhuk, dhuk dhve. Can someone tell me why there is no guna here on the anga? Why no? Does anyone remember as to why there is no uh, guna here? What kind of a pratyaya is dhva pratyaya? It is a thing pratya, thing shit sarvadhatukum. So sarvadhatuka ardhatuka yoho puganta lagu padasya There should be a guna. This is what we expect. But why there is no guna? Anyone? You can think over. If you know the answer, you can tell me now. Otherwise, you can think over. Why not? We will move ahead. So dhve. So you will get dhve. Or in another situation, this is what which this is latlakara. So this is lat. Lati, I will say Lati, Lati Dugdve, here this is Lang Lakara, so Langi, Langi Kim Rupam, Aduk Dham, Adagama you see here, so Duk plus Dham, this Dham does not become, does not take A, does not take A Adesha, but Adagama comes and sits here, uh, I think Lung Lang Rungsho, Arudattaha, Udatta and it, there is an Adagama, where will Adagama go, Adagama will go to the Angas beginning, because it is tit adyanto takito, therefore adagama goes in the beginning. So you will get adugdham. The focus here again is not anything on takarya, it is just dakara becoming dhakara. This completes the sutra. The reason is completion of the sutra. Derivation of each and every part we will see when we do tinganta. If it is clear now, well and good. If it is not, let it be hanging. Our example, if you understand Dakara became Dhakara, what is the Nimitta? This Dhva, Dhva Pratya following is the Nimitta that caused Dakara Bhash to become Dhakara Bhash. Because it is an Ekach Jashanta Anga. That is all our focus is here right now. Similarly with Lung, whether Adagama, Adagama came or not, that is a Tinganta focus. Otherwise, we will spend a lot of time in doing this and then Subanta, we may get confused. So, I will drop all of the, that entire detailed derivation exercise and just mention in Dham, this is a Lang Rupa, this is a Lat Rupa. Is that clear? 
so the sutra is complete here now we'll look at kashika counter to it as to why are all these adjectives there in the sutra visheshanas are given all this ekachaha uh, so bash bash takes bash bhava is clear but all this ekachaha uh, bashaha jashantasya soho so many uh, parts are there in the sutra we have to be alert what are the conditions and that he questions into so kashika kara says ekach hai thi kim of course these examples are also from kashika whatever is marked as with a dot here none of this is covered by lagu so lagu covers only this much this is what lagu has said all of this anyway these are lagu's example we have detailed but he does not cover anything else see dukshu is covered so dukshu is covered padante it can be padante because sakara uh, it sakara is following but it is also padanta pada definition b um, sudana punchakasya sarvanamasthanam and then swadishva sarvanamasthane padam asarvanamasthana this is being asarva asarvanamasthana and it is not ajadi therefore this is padam here we need, need not apply sakaradi this is su is a sakaradi but it is also padante so both apply which we pick is up to us of course but then i think padanta uh, condition is satisfied se is also satisfied so in this case either can be picked you can take this as an example for uh, perhaps for this se also but otherwise he does not mention anything why duhau see dug dug duhau duhau duha because it is sarvanamasthana and it is ajadi here it won't matter ajadi or not but it is sarvanamasthana sarvanamasthana has no scope of becoming padam only asarvanamasthane padam swadishu asarvanamasthane this being sarvanamasthana it cannot be pada if it cannot be pada it is uh, even if it, it is not going to become uh, jashanta at all here it is not jashanta at all duh so uh, her is much before jash hayavarat lan nyamagananam then jash starts so it, it is not jashanta anga at all therefore uh, no change in this bash here dakara remains dakara so you get duh duh ha this is jash as well as shash same idea shash also why because shash will become shash is not sarvanamasthana but shash is ajadi ajadi pratya so it has bha sanya therefore padanta will not apply so duh duh ha only in the pada place you see dakara has become dakara this is the same it is the same duh duh with quip duh with quip has declines in this manner dhug 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 duh duh ha then duham duham duh duh ha then duh so this is how it will decline only when it hits dhyam it will become dhakara so dhugvyam dhugvihi and so on till you land on dhukshu where os and all you will get only duhoho and duham also in shashti bhuvachana also no change there anyway so this completely sutra eka chaiti kim kashika karas what is eka cha why is eka cha so counter example meaning all other conditions are met except for eka cha सिद्धाम लिहम इच्छती एक्चुअली आई मीन फॉरगेट द मीनिंग मीनिंग इज अ लिटिल आई मीन दाम इज अ दा इज अ रोप इट्स अ दाम इट्स अ रोप लिह मीन्स टू लिख सो दाह दाम लिहम इट्स लिफ इज वन हु लिख्स इज नॉट वन हु लिखिंग अ रोप सो हियर यू टेक इट एज टू लिख अ रोप दाम लिहम इच्छती मीनिंग वन हु डिजायर टू लिख अ रोप in what kind of a situation we don't know but some example for vyakrana dam liham ichchati iti dam uh, iti dam lihyati it will take uh, ketch pratya i think atmavane ketch so ketch pratya it will take in the sense of ichchartha for whom for oneself atmanah ichchati one desires for oneself to lick the rope so then dam liham and here also this is upapada tatpurusha दाम लेढ़ी दाम लेह दाम लिहम 
So in whatever sense it is, uh, let us not go into meaning, it is uh, irrelevant to us. Ichyati iti dhama lihyati. So here, catch uh, pratyaya is, it is a chit pratyaya as well as it is a kit pratyaya. Content is here. So you just add here to dham lih, you will get dham lihyati. But what is the, so what happened here? Ek, is it ekach? It is not ekach. Dham liham ichyati, here dham liha, dham lih, it is not ekachanga. Therefore, what will happen here is that when, uh, what is following here? This lih. Uh, so he took ekach, ekach example, it is not ekach, that's all we will say. Anekach, it is an anekach example, therefore we can move on from here. So it is not ekach. Then, basha iti kim. Is there a bash in the ekach? Krudha krotsyati. So krotsyati is what? Here, litlakara. Litlakara, you see what has happened here is that uh, this dhakara, dhakara here is is what? Jhavaghada dash being jash, part of jash, is a jashanta. So krudh. So krudh has here, anga would be dhakaranta, it is. Uh, it is a jashantanga. Now it is ekach also. Krud. Ukara is the only ach here. It is jashanta. It is a dhato ekach. And it is jashanta. Does it have bash though? No. Kakara. It is not a bash letter. None of these are bash letters. Dhakara is a bash letter. Which is the adesha. Which is the adesha. Refa is not a bush letter, kakara is not a bush letter, therefore nothing else, whatever happens will happen here, it will not take bhash bhava, that's all, krotsyati because there is no bush at all, only bush will take bhash bhava. Jashanta seti kim, so das dhato here, you see, see da, da, not das dhato, da dhato, akaranta dhato, there is no, there is no jash in the anga, so this lrit siya pratya will just apply and you will get das seti, there is no jash at all. Very simple, nothing more to think about here, but he is giving examples as to where it will apply. So you see the Kashika style also. Soho iti kim, si sakara pare or dhva shabda pare. So is there uh, iti kim, so is bodha. So bodha here you see, uh, bodha can be, uh, it can be, uh, it can be uh, this, it's uh, like bhavita bhavitaro bhavitaraha in bhudhatu. It can be the future tense itself or it can be uh, some other like uh, uh, you, you can get in uh, trich, similar forms but then both the whatever the pratya is, this is the uh, derivation there, whichever is the pratya, it is not sakaradi, it is not dhva. So you will get bodha, bodhum, bodhavyam, bodhum is here tumul and bodhavyam, you see tavya pratya is there, none of those are sakaradi or dhva pratyas. So that completes the sutra with Kashika uh, approach also as to inquiring into each and every word. Otherwise we uh, generally know one example that uh, Duha example, Dhudhatu example which Lagukara covers and then we don't inquire into the other uh, adjectives and we don't know where all it can apply, where, where all it cannot apply. Therefore it is good once in a while at least to see. Uh, all the Visheshanas, all the uh, words in the Sutra. So that completes the Ekacho Basho Bhash Jashantasya Doho. Next Sutra introduced is for the same Dadi Dhatu and other Dhatus also which are uh, ending with Hakara. See Hodaha is the Utsarga, then Dader Dhatur Gaha is an Apavada, then we saw what happens with bhash bhava, but now in the situation that there is a hakar ending, hakara ending dhatu, uh, need not be a dhatu, an anga, an anga which is ending with hakara, uh, which has become padantana, because hoda is jali padante, we will say jali padante, hodaha, so what happens there, utsarga is dhakara adesha, but then we have to question, is it a dadi dhatu? If it is a dadi dhatu, then ghakara adesha, not dhakara adesha. Then what, an extra sutra we saw, which is 
something else happens in the anga. But here it can be a dadi dhatu which ends with hakara or you can have other dhatus which are not dadi but they are ending with hakara. But they, they optionally take ghar. So va druha muhashnuhashniham. Va druha muhashnuhashniham. What happens there? Va vibhasha is mentioned there. As to what happens, we will see esham hasya vagha jhali padante cha. So jhali padante is the anurati. If you look at 8 to 33 sutra, what do you have here? 8 to 33. Eight to thirty-three sutra here. Vadruha muhashnashniha there dhato ho ghaha ha 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 and then jali padante jali ante cha means padante cha padasya is coming down anyway. So ante cha all this is anurutti. So we can just mark them as dhato ho jali padante cha. Padasya will separate it because it is Padante is not the Anurti. Padasya Ante and then Chyo is there Jali Padante. Dhato Ho. What else? Gha Ha 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 Gha. So Ha Ha is Thani there. Ha Ha Shakti Ekvachana Gha which is Sorry, I forgot to close everything else. I have some WhatsApp things going on there. Okay. Who is that? Is the Lagu screen still visible? Okay. So, so, Esham Hasya Va Gaha Jali Padanche. Esham Hasya Hakar Seva Ha Hakar Seva Gha. Jali padante cha va vibhashe bhoti. So optionally it will take gha. Which one? This druhudhatu. Druhudhatu had ghakara already, which was nitya by dadi, being dadi dhatu. Dader dhatu gha. Hakara se gha bhoti. But now va tells you that whatever vibhash, whatever nitya tvena ghakara which was prapta, that is made optional now. And what about muhash nuhash niha? Muhash nuha and sniha are not dadi, dadi dhatu. So what was optional for, what was mandatory for it? Dhakara was mandatory. So here hakara se dhakara bhavati which was said by hodha. In these three dhatus, in the case of three dhatus, these three dhatus, there was dhakara which was mandated. Now dhakara has become optional and dhakara is given as an option. So in the... For all four, all four, dhakara or ghakara are going to be the two optional forms. Not forms, but their adeshas. Form may change further. But in this particular step, either hodha will apply or this vadruha mohash mohash niham will apply and will give you a ghakara option. So, esham dhatuna, esham dhatuna, hakara dhatuna because it is a dhatu hakara but it is why dhatu because it is also kivanta kivantam dhatu tamna jhati and dhato is following here dhato ho the anurutti is there therefore we can say dhato also dhato ho jali padasyante cha so all this is we can mark them as well jali Padante cha, padasyante so it's a tea question. So first dhatu it takes is druha. Druha dhatu what will happen? Druha, I'll not derive this druha. Hakara will become. See here you see druk and druk, then drut and drud. So if it takes, if it takes, okay, let's derive the first one. So druha. Druhu dhatu. Druhu is what? Dru is in the meaning of what? See, you know the word drohaha. So himsa, jigamsayam. So himsayam, kind of meaning droha, to hurt. So that is the meaning here. Druha. Druha will become 
सुदृह लेट मी चेक द एक्झॅक्ट धातु अर्थ गृह इज झिगाम सायम ओके सो झिगाम सायम सायम सो टू हेट और यु नो टू हिंसा मीन्स नॉट हिंसा आय झिगाम साय झिगाम साय इज टू हेट यु नो इन काइंड ऑफ स द्रोह टू इंजुअर ऑल्सो सो हर्ट मीनिंग इज ऑल्सो विद इन देअर टू इंजुअर मीन्स टू हर्ट सो टू हेट और such meaning so druha jigam sayam plus what plus quip like before there will be a quip pratya that quip pratya will go away by pakara halantyam uh, ikara upadesha jangnasikait then vera pruktasya all this then tasya lopa and then vera pruktasya lopa zero pratya you will get a karta so druha plus this you will end with druh what happens to that druh you add add what so so pratya you will get what druh and sakara lopa because halnyabhyo sutisya pruktam hal lupyate so you land with druh now druh is padanta hakara hold ha is prapta being dade dader dhato hold hold ha is negated and you land with dader dhato ghah so ghah is prapta now what ghah is mandatory va druh mohashnoshnya makes it optional so you will get what druh you will get drug drug first sorry not drug you will get drug drug and then this drug will become actually it will become drug why drug because ekacho bhasho bhash jashantasya doho then this ghakara will become gakara actually it will become gakara earlier the sequence is a little lost on me too because uh, this is not a very common sutra but you see uh, sanyoganta siloka starts here jhalo uh, jhali so jhalo jhali can cause something then jhalam uh, jhasho jhashonte is later so here nothing is following so this jhalo jhali cannot apply jhalo uh, jhali rasas se what happens here jhalo jhali lop not jhalo uh, jhali padant so it is ko se jo ko hoda no nothing else so uh, these sutras are before anta sandhi padant sandhi so jhalam jasho ante will apply after ekacho basho bhash so it will have become dhug before then it will become gakara this gakara will become gakara gakara sorry gakara will become gakara this is the this is the first form second form is what va avasane you will get char and will become kakara so this is the second form now this is taking the option of this vibhasha so by vibhasha what is happening with in the case of druha it is saying optionally you do not apply see optionally you have to make it gha so optionally gha meaning dader dhator gha is no longer the vidhi it is a vibhasha vidhi so optionally if you apply this sutra vadruha mohashnosh niham and thereby got gha then dhug dhrug or dhruk are the forms now if you do not apply this option you don't take this option then what will it fall back on it will fall back on it, it will just become druh so if it is druh then you have to see what else will apply so hoda will apply definitely hoda will apply because dader dhator gah has been negated optionally by vadruh only by vadruh not mohash no vadruh negates dader dhator gah so if you take this sutra then you will apply make make it dhrug and dhruk one of these two forms you will take the gha adesha if you do not take the gha adesha optionally then dader dhator gha cannot apply that has been negate, negated by this sutra then hodha will become an option thereby hodha will apply you will get drug drud it will become drud 
So if it becomes drud, what will happen? This dhakara, jhabhagada dhash, therefore this is also a jhash. Being jhashanta and of an ekacha dhatu, all those conditions are met and you will get drud, you will get bhashbhava. So getting bhash will take bhash and drud will become, drud will become drud. Then again you will have jhalam jashu ante. So jash you will get drud. This dakara is the is one form when you take dhakara adesha and vavasani will get, get you get you what will get you dhrut takara sorry not dhrut dhrut so these are the four forms dhrug or dhruk if you take gha adesha and dhrut or dhrut if you take dha adesha is that clear nothing difficult there this pronunciation may be more of a difficulty because it's difficult to switch within the same thing from Mahaprana to Alpaprana and vice versa. Sometimes Mahaprana precedes, sometimes it uh, follows. I hope there are no questions here. So that, that completes these four. Then Druhau and Druhaha, like uh, what we saw earlier, Druhau and Druhaha. Similarly, no change here because uh, one in, uh, in the Prathama Vibhakti, there is Sarvanamasthana and in Dvitya Vihakti Bhuvachana Druha, although Shas is not Sarvanamasthana, it is not. So again, you will have Bhashbhava, it will be Dhrugvyam, Dhrug. Two forms because, not four forms like before, because Bhakara following, it will, it will become only Gakara, only Kharicha or Avasane. Khari avasane cha char bhavati. Otherwise you will not get char. So if you don't get char, takara is not possible. If you don't get char, uh, sorry, if you if you don't get char, yeah, takara is not possible and kakara is not possible. So you will get either gakara or you will get dakara. So you will get drugbhyam or drudbhyam. Then su sthana again padam. So you will get drukshu because kakara by char. So here gakara, gakara first. By Vadruha Muhash Nuhash Niham Gha, then you will get Dhrug, Ghakara will become Gakara, and then Su, Su Sakara, Saptami Bhavachana, Su Sakara is, is a, is, makes this a Pada, makes the, it is an Asarvanamasthana and makes the earlier a Pada, or by even saying Se, Jashantasya, Doho, that is also possible, Doho, Sakara will make this take, this bash take bhash bhava and you will get drukshu. Other possibilities you don't apply this and what will happen? It will go back to hodha and dhakara will be the adesha that dhakara will become dhakara by jhalam jashuante and then because sakara is following it may become, it will become takara. So that is this form. But other possibility is it can take dhaka, this dhut. When it became Dakara, then Dasi Dhut. Dasi Dhut has brought in this Dhudagama. So Dhudagama Dakara becomes Takara and then this Takara Dakara becomes Takara. So this is the other form. So the contrast between these two forms, see this form is by Gakara Adesha by Vadruha Mosh Nosh Niham and then uh, whatever happens to Bash is common across all three forms. All these three forms have taken Bhash Bhava, the Dakara has become Dakara. What is the difference between this Drukshu and Drukshu Drukshu? This, this, is, this is due to Ghakara Adesha for Hakara. Hakara se Ghakara Adesha Bhavati. These two forms are by Hakara se Dhakara Adesha Bhavati, by Hodaha. The difference between these two now is that one has, this earlier has taken Dhudagama by Dhasi Dhut. This has not taken a Dhudagama. And thereby, because Dhudagama is what it is, it, uh, Dasi Dhut was optional. Thereby, you get two forms. Okay, I think that's what I remember. Uh, look up and make corrections if there is any. So, Eva Muk Muk. So, Muk and Muk is what? Va, Druha is done. Muha. So, Muha also will become Muk Mug. 
any of this. Moha vaichitte. So yeah, we know the word moha. In fact, we moha, mudha. This is from mohadhatu. Everyone is mohita in this prapancha. Therefore, moha is very common for us to understand. Moha vaichitte ityadi. So similarly, all of these will take different forms. Moha snuhasni. Now he moves on to snuhasniha. Snuhasniha in its additional sutra. Because this dhatu pata is shakaradi dhatu. So he adds that sutra here which converts shakara to sakara. This shakara is read in the dhatu pata, but it is actually the dhatu is sakaradi dhatu. Actually, in a sense, when you start using it in laukika, in, in loka, this, this is called as uh, snu. So snuhu and snih, but really it, in dhatu pata, it is read as. Shnuha and Shniha. So, Dhatva Adihe Shahasaha. Dhatva Adishasaha. You have to do Sandhi here. So, Dhatva Adishasaha. Optionally, Visarga also possible, but in chanting, it is always better to convert the Visarga also to uh, do a Sandhi between this Visarga that you see here, which is not really Visarga at all. Visarga need not be born and it can remain. Ru or Sakara. So Dhatva de Shasaha. Dhatva de He. Dhatuhu Adihi. Dhatva de He. Tasya Dhatva de He. Shasti Ekwachana. Shaha. Shaha is Shasti Ekwachana again. Shakar. Dhatva de He. Yaha Shakaraha. Tasya Shakarasti. Shanmuk Shakarasya. Sakara iti Dante Adesha Hoti. Dante Sakara. Sakara Adesha Hoti. That is the Sutra. You need nothing else. 6164 Angakarya. Angasya ityadi may be there, but not important here. Any dhatu which is a shakara di dhatu, shanmuk shakara di dhatu, murdhanya shakara. Shanmuk shakara means murdhanya shakara. We differentiate easy to know shanmuk shakara versus shankara shakara. So, talavya and murdhanya, if it is difficult to make bheda, a better way to say shanmuk shakara, which is murdhanya, and shankara shakara is is Talavya. Or Murdhanya Shakara Shastane Dantya Sakaraha Adesha Bhavadi. So what happens here? Shnuha Udgirane. So Shnuha Udgirane is the uh, Dhatu. So means uh, to vomit. So to vomit, uh, Shnuha Dhatu is in that meaning, but it is read as Shnuha. It is read as Snuhash, Murdhanya Shakara Adi Dhatu. So what happens? This Sutra will apply. As soon as you take this Dhatu out of the Dhatu Patha, if you want to do any Karya on the Dhatu, it will come out with this Sutra applied. Therefore, Shakara has to become Sakara. So Snuha will become Sakara. Snuha Shakara becomes Sakara. Then what happened to this Nakara? See, actually the dhatu is snuh. Okay, when he reverse engineered this dhatu, dhatu in the sense, this, the form in the laukika is always snuh. For some reason, I will I'm not go into what reason right now, but for some reason he wanted to make that shakara. So that his entire sutra order works right. Therefore, what he did is that he... He thought that it is easier to read the dhatu as shnuha in the dhatu pata than add additional sutras elsewhere. So he converted the dhatu as uh, snuha dhatu as shnuha dhatu. Once this sakara became shakara, for whatever reasons, in dhatu pata if it became shakara, then nakara cannot remain as nakara. You cannot chant it. Therefore, nakara by Rashabhyam Nona Samana Pade, Rashabhyam Shakara is preceding, that becomes a nimitta in the Dhatu Pata to convert the Nakara, Dantya Nakara, to Murdhanya Nakara. And that's how this Snuha Dhatu has become Snuha in the Dhatu Pata. Now, this, this Sutra converts that Shakara into Sakara. Therefore, nimitta is gone. What, is, what was the nimitta? Nimitta was Shakara for Nakara to become Nakara, to take Murdhanya Adesha. Murdhanya means Nonaha. Prashabhyam Nonaha 
समान पदे वॉज एप्लाइड बाय बाय पाणिनी महर्षि हिमसेल्फ सो भगवान पाणिनी एप्लाइड दैट एंड कन्वर्टेड दिस नुह धातु टू नुह इन दि धातु पाठ देर फॉर निमित्ता अपाये वन द निमित्ता इज गॉन अपाये सती निमित्ता अपाये सती निमित्ता अपाये नैमित्ति कस्या अपाय सो दिस इज दि उक्ति देर दैट विल कन्वर्ट वंस द निमित्ता इज गॉन यू नीड नॉट होल्ड दि नकारा नक एज नकारा मूर्धन्य it will come back to its original nakara form therefore snuha became snuha now this snuha has taken quip and it has become a karta so one who omits snu when you decline this snuha plus this is the pratipadika krit tadita samasascha pratipadikam then suha ujas ityadi will take su and when snuha plus su what will happen hodaha it will make it snud once it becomes snud then Jhalam Jashwanti will make it Dakara, then Dakara by Vavasani. So two forms are snood or snoot to mean one who omits. Now what happens? Vadruha muha snuha snuha because snuha dhatu is sitting there. What happens? Vadruha muha snuha snuha what? Gaha. Gaha adesha bhoti. So ghakara adesha, thereby it will become snug. Then Jhalam Jashwanti ga. So this is third form. Fourth form is Vavasani char. वावसानी चर भोती सुचर एंड यू विल गेट ककार आदेश हियर वर्ग प्रथम बेसिकली वर्ग ककार इज वर्ग तृतीय आदेश जश एंड देन वर्ग प्रथम सो व्हाट इज सी लुक एट द सीक्वेंस जश झशंतस्य स्नुहो व्हाट इज जश दैट इज झश इज वर्ग चतुर्थ देन भश भाव व्हाट इज भश वर्ग चतु वर्ग तृतीय सॉरी झश इज झश इंक्लूड्स भश ऑल्सो सो झ भश सो झश इज वाइडर भश इज झ भ सो वर्ग चतुर्थ आर टॉक्ड अबाउट बाय झश एंड भश झश इंक्लूड्स ऑल फाइव भश इंक्लूड्स फोर एक्सेप्टिंग झ झकार देन व्हाट इज भश भश इज लाइक झश the comparison between jhash and bhash what is it only drop jhakara varga chaturtha but without jhakara will give you bhash similarly jhash this jhalam jashwante this jhash what is jhash jhash is varga tritiya you drop jhakara you will get bhash so bhash takes bhash bha adesha so jhash is varga tritiya bhash is also varga tritiya except for jhakara char what is char चर इज वर्ग प्रथम सो दीज आर दी आदेश यूसी इन दी धातु पाठ जनरल जनरल यू कैन लुक एट दीज पॉसिबिलिटीज ऑफ वर्ग तृतीय चतुर्थ पंचम इत्यादि अनुनासिका आर वर्ग पंचम हियर यू सी द लास्ट धातु ध्रुह मुह स्नुह स्नेह स्नेह स्नेम थे सेम थिंग शकारा धात्वादेश स विल मेक दिस एज सकारा देन निमित्तापाए नैमित्त क्या अपाय therefore you will get nakara and then sneha dhatu sneha pritau sneha pritau sneha sneha you have to nasalize this with the eighth letter sneha pritau so sneha pritau plus script will give you pratipadika sneha plus su sakara this will go away by halnya abhyo dirgha sutisya praktam hal lupyate then hodaha is one possibility or vadroha muhash nuhash niyam is another possibility so by Slash we see this hoda and vadruha muhashnuhashnyam gha. Dhakara or ghakara are one of the two adeshas there. If you get dhakara by jashtom, you will get dhakara, so you will get snid. And by vavasane, if you apply char, then you will get snig. Sorry, not snig. This should be snit. There is a there is an error there. And here in uh, if you have take gha adesha, you will get snig by jash. and then snick by char what is his next example now so he moves on he's finished this dhatus now he suddenly moves on to vishwa what has absolutely no relation to dhatva desha sah it has no relation to this hoda it has no relations relation to dader dhatu or bash bhav none of this he is just moving on to what he is moving on to halanta another halanta pullinga that's all 
he's gone back to his prakriya avasthana prakriya his prakriya his prakriya he's continuing with his prakriya with this is just another pullinga ending with hal what is that vishwa vat what is this dhatu vah of course there is a relation because vah dhatu is a halanta dhatu it is a hakara hakaranta dhatu also but has nothing to do with this sutra rather i should say nothing to do with this sutra where it is listed dhatva de shasa so here you see double uh, this double vertical lines perhaps that means that it is ended the sutra is ended now is continuing with his uh, his prakriya where he is going to take another pulling shabda that pulling shabda happens to be vishwa vat why vishwa vat vishwam vahati iti vishwa plus am plus vah prapane plus mi mi pratyay sam mi pratyay is there i you need not worry about that but mi pratyay is nit pratyay what can nit nit pratyay do what can nit pratyay do to the anga we'll finish the sutra and talk what can nit pratyay do vriddhi so where will the vriddhi be now you look at this vriddhi here where will the vriddhi be vah dhatu hakara cannot take vriddhi so ata upadhaya ha niti niti pare vriddhi bhavati angasya angasya kasya atah angasya atah at upadhaya this atha which is the at at which is the upada at upadhaya atah vriddhi bhavati therefore a of vah which is at it is an upada letter and that will take vriddhi mean it will become ah ah it will become ah sorry so vah will become vah therefore you get vishwa vah this is upapada tatpurusha so ni pratya is some some pratya in the third chapter in the which will make this as upapada tatpurusha samasa so you got vishwa vah vishwa vah is a pratipadika now krittadit samasascha uh, sorry not uh, yeah so here vishwa vah plus v so v where apruktasya lopa bhavati it will go away and then you will have vishwa vah plus su once you have vishwa vah plus su then hoda will apply so i i made a mistake by saying that it has nothing to do with uh, hoda it does but it has nothing to do with the uh, dhatva dehe shahasa and section of course uh, utsarga and apavadas are there but the dhatva dehe shahasa has nothing to do with that section itself therefore it has nothing to do this vishwa vah has nothing to do with the uh, sutra dhatva dehe shahasa so vishwa vad then again jhalam jashwante will give you jash dakara and then one form is vishwa vad the other form is va avasane char you will get vishwa vat so that the uh, that's the sutra here i think we did only one sutra or two sutras today uh, and we saw the other forms here so we'll stop here i'll continue on uh, in the next week on the ignana samprasaranam ityadi stop here tatavasane nataraj rajo nana dadhakkan nav panchavaram uddhar tu kamas sanakadi siddhan विमर्शे शिव सूत्रजान एनी क्वेश्चन आई होप इट्स क्लियर आई मीन दी सूत्र दैट वी सॉ लास्ट टाइम एज वेल एज दिस टाइम if tinganta is not understood it's not an issue but i hope even tinganta is understood not all the sutras but where it is applicable se dve pare that is bho okay namaste